Okay, we're gonna go. We're gonna switch to the Nintendo Entertainment System. Um, I have the Last Ninja. She's better than the first Ninja. I have uh, Marble, Marble Madness. Marble Madness, man. Marble that Madness. I think that that should be the game. Okay, let's do Marble that Madness. Reminds me of my youth. I have to. You still have to blow like this. It's not that the Retron Five doesn't kick ass. It's that these cartridges are how old? Uh, thirty years. Thirty old? years. I mean, old? Some of them, yeah, they got to be thirty years old. So. Yeah, you have to get I heard them. I still got my old Super NES games. I should bring them up. I heard the blow doesn't do anything. I'll buy them off you. Well, if you blow, you, if you blow on the tip. Oh, I know, that's tip. what I was thinking. Yeah, you got to blow on the tip and it'll work. You got to tell my kids this is what Get I want up, for man. Christmas. Hit here it goes. Oh, damn. Dave's getting on, on some He's of the action this time. Possessive. Bogarting that. Um, Marble Madness. Hey, Dave, you do you have this? an affinity no, for Marble Madness? Yeah, I used to play Marble Madness. Okay, two player. You ready, Dave? Uh. Ass. Uh, ass. Well, ass. Almost ass, enough. Ass, ass uh, wipe. Rub. Rub that. What is that, 90 You can always thing? do the 90 and 45 degree. I always do the 90. Uh, I guess the 45, you, it's less sensitive. You know, so you have to put you... Yeah, it's less sensitive. I think that's the way to put it. I think it's angles, but ultimately... It equates to you like trying to push harder or whatever. Two balls, of course. Two balls. There is a button to go faster. Two boobies down at the bottom. There's one. No. Oh, There's wow. one button that makes you go faster. I was playing this with my buddy Brandon. He got to the level six, and come to find out that it's actually the last level. And Marble Madness is one of the shortest games uh, there is, if you can beat it. The problem is it's hard as shit to now, beat it. How would you guys describe Marble Madness in one word for the people that are listening to the podcast? Um, um, Speechless. Uh, uh, I got it. Uh, billiards. Billiards? billiards? I, I don't know. <laughs> Marbles. <laughs> and madness. That's two words, but we'll take it. Oh, I got dizzy. So is that the balls crying, or is that uh, what, what exactly is it? Uh, yeah, I guess so. It's uh, uh, some balls crying. Yes, crying balls. Oh, I did it again. Now, Dave, uh, do you remember in your youth ever beating this game? No. You don't remember, or you just you never. Beat I don't it? remember beating it. I don't oh. remember this damn game. I just remember um, how you know, cool Dave's it was. busting his balls right now. <laughs> this game's a real ball buster. I think because when this came out, people thought of this like, "Oh my God, this is really a 3D uh -huh. game," where it's it's not, but um, but it no, absolutely you. not. Um, but it, it it plays like one, you know. Oh, what are you doing? You're killing me. Uh, so uh, in this game, are you guys actually racing each other or? Yeah, yeah, because you have to get over the. Um, oh, I got a five second penalty. Another five second oh, penalty. Fuck. This thing sucks. I hate it. Uh, <laughs> you guys yeah. keep dropping your balls in the hole. <laughs> Uh, I'm not out of make time. It. Well, this game over. is terrible. <laughs> <laughs> the game is terrible. Is that what you said? Yes. The game? Or, or are you terrible? I am That's terrible the at the game. Why did I die? Oh, I'm out of, I'm out of time. Kept I was in out the of hole. time. I was out of time. That's why I said red. Oops. But, um. I don't know. This game is kind of weird, dude. It's very weird. You want to try? <laughs> no, it's, uh, it's. it's. Oh, I, I dig this music, though. I don't get to play anymore. I mean, that's one of my favorite things about. Oh. oh. Oh, yeah, the music's pretty cool. Oh, the music on NES games were always fantastic for the most part. So it's like this marble going down this kind of like maze, this 3D maze. Yeah, remember yeah. Qbert? Qbert was like that. Yeah, it was kind of in that you know Qbert Crystal Castles. They were starting to do a lot of these like 3D looking things, which were interesting. But I want to show you something real quick. Again, not to harp on this too much, but I turn off the filter and I go back to the game. Oh, and wow. it's such an incredible difference. And so think about it in terms, if you're not playing on the Retron, you hooked up to your NES, this is what you got. It's just, for me, it's a, it's, it matters. Like, it's a pretty different experience, you know? Um, Dave passed the controller to me, even though I can't do anything with my <laughs> balls. Should I switch out games? Tom's playing with his balls. Yeah, I guess we could do a game switch since... Uh, this sucks, man. Six, Five seconds, four, three. I'm but, sorry, this game dude, sucks, this dude. Game, <laughs> Dang, this game you guys are pretty harsh. All right, so uh, you can only play with your ball. pull it out. The thing about when you first get the Retron, putting in the cartridges is actually a pretty tight uh, fit. 
That's what she said. And uh, <laughs> so it, it's it's um it does loosen up a little bit over time. But that's I think, also what she said. Um, 